This week on the Highlander Report, the soldiers of the Highlander Brigade travel to Fort Irwin, California to train in tactical desert combat in the National Training Center. Soldiers train in many areas including force-on-force -force combat, working with the local population, talk operations, and live fire exercises. Uh, NTC brings uh, the idea of real combat without the danger. Uh, gives soldiers the ability to experience as close as they can get to the real thing without their lives being in danger and it provides the best training they can get. It's almost like a glorified laser tag. Uh, you get Miles gear, just a simple vest and one goes around your Kevlar. Uh, also there's a laser sight attached to the end of your weapon. So it really is, it's like laser tag for, for grown ups. The Highlanders spent two weeks in the field training and two weeks in the rotational unit bivouac area for preparations and equipment turn-in procedures. I definitely believe NTC is beneficial especially prior to deploying. Um, it gives you an opportunity to practice your individual and, and squad and section and, and all those skills fine-tuned back at home station. It gives you an opportunity to practice them as a collective group and that is how you would actually fight in combat. Oh, it was definitely difficult. Uh, it's, it's hot. It, it, it was definitely hot out here. Uh, you had to stay hydrated, you had to stay focused. Uh, you're sleeping outside, it gets just as cold as, as it does hot. I mean, it was, it was freezing at night and it was hot during the day. Uh, the sand, the, the, the terrain was unfair, the terrain was rugged, uh, vehicles and repairs, it was, it was, it was tough, but uh, it, was definitely, it was definitely good training. For 41 AD and Fort Bliss, I'm Army Sergeant Mike Grimm. And as always, that's your Highlander Report.